secularism, a philosophy which attempts to achieve human betterment without reference to God or religion. It is based upon assumption that materialism is true. It is thus man-centered, materialistic and temporally oriented. It is expressed in modern man trusts in science over God and his preoccupation with this world over the world to come. It is the full harvest of enlightenment philosophy, a harvest of desperation and a sense of meaningless that has spawned the widespread breakdown of modern society. Secularism is most obvious in the separation of the state, its laws, government, courts, and political and social policy from all religious, i.e., Christian, moorings. It is more than the separation of church and state as envisaged, for example, in the United States Constitution. It is the separation of the state from God in order to establish its dependence upon the faith of secular humanism. Secularism takes on a particularly reprehensible aspect when it invades the church. There it asserts, religion is private, not a public matter and shows its concern to be this worldly rather than otherworldly. It redefines the gospel, the mission of the church, and the manner and sphere of Christian life in terms of social action and human relationships. It is worldliness, fulfilling the old saying, I looked for the church and I found it in the world, I looked for the world and I found it in the church. Secularism is disastrous alike for the church, for the state, and for the individual. It is the epitome of man's depraved and corrupted state and is the very essence of man's age-old rebellion against God. Far from being the answer to the needs of men, it is a problem that needs the solution provided by the gospel and received through repentance and faith.